welcome to my YouTube channel. In the last session, I could give a brief idea about Paston's law. As everybody know that, according to Paston's law, voltage is a function of product of pressure and distance. Now I have to derive the formula. Voltage, I have to state that, I have to verify, voltage is a function of product of pressure and distance. Now let us derive for an expression for Paston's law. So questions may be asked like this. Derive an expression, that means question. I'll derive an expression for Paston's law. Derive an expression. Derive an expression for Paston's law. Paston's law. These questions had repeated many more times in VTU examination. And Anna University also I could find out many of the questions related to Paston's law. Now let us derive an expression for Paston's law. As everybody know that. The Townsend's current growth equation, I can rewrite Townsend's current growth equation, I is given by I naught into e to the power alpha d whole divided by 1 minus gamma into gamma into e raised to alpha d minus 1, where alpha is known as Townsend's primary ionization coefficient and the gamma is known as Townsend's secondary ionization coefficient. Now what you can do is, Apply breakdown condition. Applying breakdown condition. So, denominator part can be equated to 0. So, how can I modify the equation? Denominator part is this one only. So, gamma into, I will be writing directly, e to the power alpha d minus 1, that is equal to 1. Please call this one as equation number 1. According to Townsend's law, both alpha and gamma, I can write both alpha and gamma in terms of, in terms of, in terms of electric field, and pressure, electric field and pressure. So what I can do, alpha I will be writing in terms of electric field and pressure. So alpha, alpha is Townsend's primary ionization coefficient, alpha, that means alpha by P, alpha by P, that is given by function of F1 of, that means function, function of E by P, function of E by P, where E is known as electric field, P is known as pressure. But you know, Electric field is the ratio. Electric field can be written as E is equal to V by D. Volt per distance. Volt per distance is known as electric field. That formula I think you must have studied during PU classes or plus 2 classes. So same thing will be applying here. That means uh, F1 of, how can I write? V by PD. V by PD. V by PD. In the same fashion, I am going to write, I am going to write the expression for uh, Townsend secondary ionization coefficient gamma that means gamma that is proportional to gamma that is equal to F2 of F2 of E by P E by F2 of E by E by P or else F2 of V by P. Okay, that means gamma. If you want to call equation, this one as equation number 2, this one as equation number 3. Now what you can do? Substitute equation number 2 and 3 in equation number 1. Where is equation number 2? That you know. Equation number 2 and 3 into equation number 1. Hope you are understanding my point. Now what we can write? Gamma. What is gamma? Gamma means F2. F2 of V by PD. Okay. Then open the bracket. E to the power. What is alpha? Alpha by P is equal to F1 into V by PD. So how can I write alpha? Alpha equal to P can be moved on to RHS. That means alpha means P into P into what will what will be the remaining thing? F1 of F1 of V by PD F1 of V by PD Then which one is remaining? Here D is remaining no? So D Okay Minus 1 That is equal to 1 Now Look at the final equation Let it be 4 Look at the final equation if I look at final equation very very keenly or very clearly, what I can say? F2 of V by PD. Similarly, e, e, e to the power P into F1 of V by PD. So, V by PD become a common factor. 
okay so by looking at the equation number 4 voltage pressure distance here also f f1 voltage pressure distance f1 as well as f2 that means by explaining those functions f1 and f2 three parameters will be considered voltage and the product of pressure and distance by looking at that i can write voltage must be voltage must be uh, a function of product of pressure and distance this theory is known as Paston's law or Paston's theory most important theory where d is the distance between two electrodes and p is the pressure of the gaseous medium and v is the breakdown voltage how to find out minimum breakdown voltage means you draw the Paston's curve then extrapolate the graph towards y-axis then you will come to know what is the minimum value of breakdown voltage to cause the dielectric breakdown of gaseous dielectric material this theory is generally known as Paston's theory uh, this simple derivation will be asked in many of the university examination. So thank you for listening this video. Please share with your friends and kindly subscribe. Thank you.